What's going on, Internet? Zyajic here, coming at you with another Mega Man Battle Network 5 video. Last time, Lan had Colonel as, or got Colonel as a replacement because Mega Man has been captured. And Mega Man has now turned to the dark side. So, now we've got to go figure out how, or what we're going to do, because now Mega Man is guarding End Area. Nebula got Mega Man, I see. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have stopped, Colonel. Now it'll be even harder to liberate any area. It's okay. Even if Colonel had shut down Mega Man, it wouldn't—it wouldn't have stopped from. It wouldn't have stopped the Nebula backup coming. With the Nebula forces in end area having overcome Mega Man, we've lost a lot of ground. It's a serious problem. Yeah. Well, how about taking in Nightman or Shadowman? Then? Both great navvies, that's for sure. But we're up against too many. Even if we had Mega Man, we couldn't. We couldn't beat them without casualties. We re what, what we need right now is an ally with serious power who can take out a bunch of enemies in a single blow. Yeah, but who? Anyway, we can't just go into any area without a plan. For now, I need you to work on another task, Lamb. Another task? Right now, the luxury passenger liner, Queen Bohemia, is on port behind Scilab. I've got wind of a party that's going to be held on board. On the ship that tomorrow by this certain company from Electopia. The guest list is full of the world's top business people and royals. Sounds pretty important. Uh, excuse me. What's it all about? Ubercore, the company hosted hosting the party, is going to present a booster system that is developed or that they have developed. Yeah. Apparently it can multiply the power of any program. You should go to the present the presentation I, I mean auction. Auction? So they're going to sell this booster system? Yes. And we've reason to believe that Nebula is after it. And it's a system that can power up programs, right? Nebula got a hold of something like them. That's your task to stop um, that's your task to stop that from happening. Roger. So I'll have to get to the Queen Bohemia tomorrow then, right? Yes. Except you'll need an invite to aboard the ship. And I suppose you don't have one, right? Suppose correctly. You'll have to get yourself in somehow. What? I don't know any top business people be with royals. No way. I do know a royals person. I'll go ask now. See you, Barrel. Land. What's wrong? It's about Mega Man. You know I might come up against him as an enemy. If we do, would you be able to take him out? If Mega Man's soul's been completely overrun by darkness, then yes, I'll take him out. Then I'll have to. Really? Yes. He says that without a huff. So basically, Barrel's plan consists of getting Lan onto an exclusive party and has no plan to get him on. He just leaves that up to Lan. Fortunately, we know I know how to get on there. You might be thinking, if you've been watching the series up to now, well, why don't you just go talk to Yai? I mean, she should be able to get on. Well, I'll show you what happens when you do. All right, where's your eyes? There's your eyes, house. Ain't back to the party on Queen Bohemia. Silly you! Why would I have one? Only the most elite CEOs in the world and corporations. A few princes are invited to that one. So yeah, that's pretty much your clue um, as to who to go talk to. Uh, Yai apparently is not important enough to uh, to uh, go uh, to get on a party like that. And I don't know why it's so hard to get to ordinary. Anyhow, we can talk to Princess Pride here. Oh, it's you, Lamb. What can I do you for? Well, actually, I was wondering if you got an invite to the party being held on the Queen Bohemia. An invite? Yes, I think I did. If you don't mind, I was wondering if I could have it. That's fine, Lan. But why don't you go... But why do you want to go to the party? It's work. Ah, work. You're certainly busy, Lan. I hope nothing bad happens. Lan got the invite. Thanks. Are you sure you don't mind? Didn't you mind... Didn't you want to go? I don't really like parties. I'm sure you'll get more out of it than I. Thanks. Okay, I'll be on my way then. She just hands it over. Not just no no questions asked. All right. Wait, actually, oh, that's right. We gotta go back home. All right, back home. Hey, mom. Never heard Mega Man. Oh, I haven't heard Mega Man around. Did you two fight? Oh, she's really oblivious. 
All right, well, we're gonna go to bed. All right. Okay, I guess it's time to get going. Party full of rich people. <laughs> I'm nervous already. Better pull myself together. Yeah! I just want to take a, just a, some time to take note that Mom is literally watching nothing on TV. She's just staring at a blank screen. Wow. Um, I can see why Dad married her. There's not a lot going on up there except maybe uh, how to cook. I'm sorry. I apologize if that offended anyone. <laughs> Whoops, I need to go to the- I need to go to the actual port! The, the boat, please. Jeez. Alright. Uh, not there. <clears throat> I need to talk to you. Excuse me. May I see your invite, please? That's fine, you're welcome to go on board. Alright, let's go. Once you boarded, you can't return for a port for a while. Is that alright? Yup. Mm. Then please step on board. What a ship. These rich guys sure know how to throw a party. This is passenger announcement. We are now departing. A further announcement will be made when the party is about to begin. We wish you all a pleasant voyage. The vessel is now leaving port. Jesus Christ, who just freaking farted? Oh, looks like we're looks like we're away. Wow, you can't you can't feel it roll at all. Okay, Colonel, what's the plan? First, we check to see if there's anyone suspicious on board. Roger. Ah, I see. It'll be done before the party starts. Yes, of course. Thank you. Who's this dork? How are you enjoying the cruise? Sorry, but the engine room is out of bounds for passengers. Oh, sorry. Which way is the deck, then? You need to go back along this corridor the other way. Oh, right. Thanks. Alrighty. He's suspicious. Uh-oh. He's coming this way! Act natural! Ugh. <sighs> He's gone! What now, Colonel? Let's just tread water for now. So, you, you want me to just, like, jump off the ship? Or is there a pool on the ship? Maybe we can do... Tread water? So there's a pool on board? Or, or do you mean diving into the sea? That's dangerous! I meant, let's l let him carry on what he's doing for a way that he won't... Let him carry on doing what he wants for a bit, you, you moron! Jeez. Away and see if he does anything unusual. Oh, right. Special crime busting talk. <laughs> I'll remember that. I guess I'll just be treading water then. No, not in. Oh, never mind. Alright, um. Don't need the chip trader, because once again, we have every single chip. Um. Uh, need to talk to you. Ah, hello there. I'm a member of the ship's crew. And I'm putting on a bit of a muse uh, entertainment to amuse the guests until the party starts. You can take part in the free net battle up there on stage, or there's a mystery stamp rally. There's the stamps are hidden around the ship. The net battle looks a bit busy right now. Why don't you have a go at the mystery stamp rally? Sure. Great. So I'll give you some clues, and you have to go find the stamps and bring them to me. There are three stamps in total. They're hidden behind or under things on board. Here are the clues. Spin it around left and right. Where we sail the maiden stairs, it repels all light and always reflects me. That's it. Put the stamps in this. Good luck. Oops. Gonna hit the hit the desk for good luck. So yeah, you can get one on the the. Um, I don't remember what you call this. The maiden stamp. Another one on the helm. 
right up here. I'm a little surprised that they'll just let anybody up here. Alright, got that one. And the one that repels light is a little tricky unless you actually know what it's talking about. Um, that would be the mirror in the main hall where I was at. Well, it's not actually the mirror. It's actually over here. Repels all light and always reflects this. A mirror repels all light. And that mirror over there is reflecting this under the sofa. Alright. Got it. Alright, I get your freaking stamps. Bart knocker. Ah, so you collected all the stamps. Here's your prize then. A thousand zen. Wow, a whole ten freaking dollars. Wow. Congratulations. No way, I'm beat. Now you just suck at it. It's not possible. It cost me 10 million zennies to customize my navy. How can I be so outclassed? <laughs> Alright, what voice do we give to Dingo here? Um, where are the cable guy? I got it. You spend all your cash you want on your navy. You won't win. I hate rich people like you. What did you say? Who let this low life on the ship? Somebody from Superior, Wisconsin is calling me, and you can piss off. Freaking telemarketer. Ha! Isn't there anyone better on board? I invited him to spice uh, the battle of challenge up a bit. His name's Dingo. No one's ever been able to defeat him. Why don't you give it a go? Never defeated? I'll teach him a thing or two. I'm Lan. You, you want a challenge? Take me on. Take on me. But you gotta get, uh, you, what is it? You gotta get rotosculpt in black and white and shit, get chased around by rotosculpt biker guys, you know. You know what I'm talking about. You seem pretty sure yourself. And you look pretty determined too. I'll wipe the floor with you. You think you can bring? If you can, bring it on. Oh, the crab! Somebody took a little match when they took a crab. Land. That means Nebula's on the move. I mean, somebody got went to Taco. It's that. It's that nerd guy. He just he got on the boat and he lit a match. He was taking a shit. That shaking must mean the engine room's been hit. Okay, on my way. Sorry, this will have to wait. Ah. Everyone's too chicken. But you seem different. Sure, see you later. Alrighty. Well, we gotta get in here. Code red. Switch to manual mode. Please enter security code. Let's see it. If I remember correctly. One. I think was it two? No, it was like yeah, I had nine one one in it, so it was like whoops. Oh wow, I actually got it right. I couldn't didn't even wasn't even sure if I remembered it. Well, security code check passed. Door unlocked. <laughs> Pressurized. Okay, it's open. Careful, anything could be there. Okay. Yeah, I remember the nines in the one portion, but I didn't, wasn't sure about the two hundred or the two, or excuse me, the two two hundred two. So, this is the engine room. First, I better find a place to jack in. Wonder if he can, if one can jack into this. Oh, cool! There's a port. I could jack in. We'll do it then. Instead of staring at it, you idiot. Look at that! There's a Nebula Navi! Nebula Navi, huh? Huh! Who the heck are you? You won't get away with- you won't get the booster system. 
And you won't get away. Yeah, you think you can stop me? As he just blocks off. Click? What does that mean? Ooh, BMD. That battery. I guess we need to fight electric viruses. We can. And regular up to you. I've had enough of you. Get ready. Change of tactics. I'm checking out. You're lucky. This isn't over. Colonel, I'm jacking out to you. <laughs> oh, now what? <laughs> Just trip over himself or something? What's that? Ah! Uh oh. Big adios. Wait! Wait, land. What, Colonel? He's getting away! We mustn't rush. The criminal's still on board. And we know what he's after. Could be dangerous to act on impulse. He'll turn up at the party for sure. We'll take our time and make sure we, we catch him there. I guess you're right. This is a passenger announcement. The party preparations are complete. Please make your way up to the fiesta room. We have burritos. Also, whoever freaking farted and blew a hole in the hall, we are going to need to escort you off the off the boat because we're gonna need to show you. At last, the party's gonna start. <clears throat> now, now we'll get that guy. <laughs> What's up, lady? Everyone's already gone to the party. You should hurry along there too. DON'T TELL ME HOW TO LIVE MY LIFE! Wow. Fancy schmancy in here. And uh, holy crap. There's a freaking chuck roast there. And cake! It's a lie. It's a lie! Oh. Well, what are we doing? Let's gather some info before the party starts. Do we gotta talk to people? I never get bored of these flavors. I wonder if I could take some wrap to take away. Ah, uh, just like some elderly lady. Gotta take it home and savor it. The food's superb. All made with the finest ingredients. Good to know. This lady's the boss of the famous oil company, you know. Which one? Exxon Mobil? This gentleman's the boss of an IT-related industry that holds a huge market share worldwide. He's a very handsome man. Well, why don't you two just get a room? Are you enjoying yourself? There's food today is being cooked by a top chef. Call it, one call from Netopia's finest restaurants. Screw Netopia. Bunch of frickin' vagabonds and miscreants. This is my company's best ever business opportunity. The party has to go perfectly. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen. All six of you. I would like to thank you all for attending this party today where we at Ubercore are proud to unveil our new booster system. When added to any existing program, this booster system radically enhances the program's performance. Construction work, software R&D. It can be used with anything, including, of course, net navvies. We're offering it to just, for just 300 million zenny. 300 million? That's... One, ten, hundred thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand. That's eight zeros. No way. Three hundred million. What a bargain. Let's see the device then. Um, you just say it was a bargain? So without further delay, the booster system is currently inside the view computer. If, I, if everyone would care to take a look, here it is. This is the booster company system that our company has developed. 
Surrounding it are guard navvies, reinforced with a booster system. They are ten times more powerful than normal navvies. Ooh. Ah. And now you will all witness the power of the booster system. A power cut? What's going on? Oh. Hulk smash! What's happening? Is the booster safe? Booster system safe? Turn the lights on quickly! They're all dead. Ah! It's gone! The booster system! What the? The booster system's been stolen! Ya think? This is Nebula's doing. Where's that guy? Wait a minute. Um. Hey, mister. When the power cut out, did you see anyone going in and out of this room? No way. I was gutting the door of the exit this whole time. A mouse couldn't even got past me. And the thief is still in this room. Hey! This guy was hiding under the table. Well, okay. <laughs> what do you think you're doing? Uh, I don't know anything about this. But playing innocent. Yeah, didn't do nothing. Whatever, dude. Hey! Where's the booster system? Give it back now! It wasn't me! <laughs> oh my god, this is too perfect. Oh, come on now. Do you expect us to believe that? You're hiding it under your clothes. Ah! Quit touching me there! Oh no! It's not in his PET, and it's not in his clothes. Where is it? I already told you I don't know. I was just about to take it when the lights went down. What? No, there's not a thief at work here. Yeah, I'm not the only one. We got another criminal to find out among these people. Lad, it seems to me that everyone in the room is innocent. The thief must have somehow jacked into the view computer, de defeated the eight garden navvies, and taken the booster system. It would, uh, uh, it would have been real hard to operate a navy in the dark and near impossible to beat those beefed up guard navvies, so it must have been some kind of trick. Let's look for clues. And this is where I literally don't know what I'm doing anymore, so I will be going in blind. So as of now, guys, I will go ahead and stop here. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I'll be seeing you all in the next video. So thank you very much for watching. May God bless you all. See you in the next one.